Quick recap, he just escaped a crazy man who was an executive and he decided that he wanted to play doctor. We have also lost two fingers. There's one. And if I can find a bed to hide under, I can show you the other one. Or better yet, I'll just come to this and do like this. Yeah, that doesn't work. Yes. What do you mean I can't carry no more batteries? Oh, I got five out of five, that's why. Okay, well, I know where there's a battery now. Let me see if I can't just, like, quickly find, like, a bed or something to hide under. Beef. This was for dinner. Ah, fuck it. At some point, you will see that I lost the other another finger on the right hand. Pretty sure that's a dead guy. Got nothing for me. It's over here. file. Oh, it's probably all waterlogged and shit. That's not gonna be good. I don't even know your name, but I've come to think of you as one of my blood. My Paul. I hope you don't mind, and I hope you don't indulge the vanity of self-pity. The fear that you... That, that your suffering is more than others. We all must endure this, and you are nearly done. There's no way to heaven but by the cross. And every man needs another to help drive the nails in. I'm here for you. I'm waiting ahead. Well, that's not creepy at all. Okay, well, that's locked. Pretty sure that guy's dead. Check out over here. Can't get in there. This door needs a key. Do you have a key? No, you're just fucking dead up against the building. where I came in, or came out of. Without this night vision on. What that? What is that light? What the fuck is that thing? Was that? 
batteries are almost dead. Now we got full batteries again. Be terrified too. Okay, where's the door? Where's the, where's the door? This door? It's this one. Let's go ahead. Close that. enemies from fucking uh, fear. Fuck me running. I have to go this way. I got some notes. God help me, I think I've seen the wall rider. A fucking dark cloud shaped like a dude. Okay, yeah, there's a ladder. Jesus Christ, it is so fucking dark. I may increase the gamma just a little bit. So it doesn't look so horrible. And it's still it it's still dark. It's not for me, it's for the video, Ken. So people don't just stare at blackness for hours. Bitch, I played through amnesia, alright? And countless other... There's a dude just sitting there. Yeah, right there, buddy? He's alright. He's gonna stay there. Playing through Raven Home without a flashing light. Yeah, well... That wasn't my fault. <laughs> You know what? I might as well stay over here and just get that battery from him. Thanks, pal. I'm just guessing I'm supposed to be hardcore parkouring all this. on that barbed wire, that would really fucking hurt. Okay, we made it. Oh, I guess I can't jump over there. Are you dead? You don't look dead. You look like you're gonna be a jump scare. Okay, no, you're dead. You got a lot of blood coming off of you. And the door's locked. Oh, again? Huh. 
Ooh, that wasn't really flush. That still would have stung like a motherfucker. Have to get out. You're already out, buddy. Uh. The half naked dude. Okay. trying to take a piss. Alright, we don't need to videotape that guy taking a piss in the corner. Alright, I gotta go this way. Oh my god, oh my god, it's fucking Walker! He found me! This is a tiny, this is a real tiny spot. Like, I just kind of squeezed into. It's over there! I go this way. Oh, how this walker guy always finds me. This guy's got really good balance. I, I would not have this good of balance. Just gotta do the Call of Duty heal. Alright, we're good. Just sprained my ankle is all. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, I get squeezed through. <laughs> he kicked me in the ass and killed me. because there was nothing there! Yeah, with his, definitely with his third leg. Oh, he's got chains wrapped all around his legs. Alright, well, it's a little bit brighter here. Just a fountain full of blood. That's what you want to see. Only a couple of things come to mind when you see a fountain full of blood. One is Diablo, where if your character's injured and you find a fountain of blood, you click on it once and it heals one health point. And you have to sit there and spam that shit. And the other one is, uh, this is, this is, this must be where the vampires are. What 
do you throw into a fountain of blood to make a wish? It can't be just like a coin. These are the questions that nobody wants to ask. These are the questions that nobody wants to answer either. <laughs> Alright, I'm in. A little wet, a little cold, but we're in. Door is locked. Can't start that door is locked. You saw the wall rider, didn't you? I saw something. You're beginning to understand, but not yet. Even Abraham had to cast his eyes to the ground. But soon, soon. This way! Revelation is at hand! Okay! Anything f Nope, you're dead. He's a corpsey corpse. Why isn't anybody killing this, uh... The father guy? Like, he's just as crazy as everybody else in here. It should be... Dead guy that has a battery. Alright, remember that dead guy in the hallway. <laughs> and that guy that was there is gone. Is somebody gonna burst out of this door now? Let's squeeze through there. And go through there. know what's in there. And apparently I wrote a note. The sound in the machine. The sound of the machine, like the sound in my head when the wall rider appeared. I blink and I see static. Something else. Something oily and dark descending behind my eyelids. Watching me with organs, I can't imagine. But the sound is coming from the machine too. From inside the walls, I know that sound. I'll reload these now. No, I bet if you played these horror games without the music, it wouldn't be so bad. This looks like the front door. It's a different front door. What's downstairs? Hello there. A folder! 
did such a thing. Over PB and J too. Thank you so much for the follow. Very much appreciate that, and welcome. And I hit the wrong button. This one. Nazi War Crimes Disclosure Act. A. The first paperclip provides a means of obtaining services of foreign specialists for specific assignments within the technical services of the departments of Army, Navy, and Air Force. B. Project 63 is primarily a denial program with utilization as a desirable feature. The aim of this program is to secure employment in the United States of, the, of certain preeminent German and Austrian specialists thus denying their services to potential enemies. Hmm. Hmm. Boy. So glad I came down here and got that note. And that's the sound that movies normally make when there are spiders nearby. That's how you can hear it. It's faint. It is like the noise. Whenever something is a like creepy crawly, they're gonna use that. I always loved how in games they have lights like this. It's just hanging by a wire and swinging. It's like, I think if it was in real life, that wire would have snapped long ago. Can I manipulate it by hitting it with my head? Oh, I guess I can't jump that high. Well, I mean, you know the old adage, white men can't jump. And this door needs a key. Should I go back and tell him, hey, I need a key. Do you know where it is? Preferably not in the hands of somebody who wants to kill me with a board with a nail in it. Uh, this has seen some fire damage. out of there you tell me that you couldn't get your fingers around that key and pull it off all right well I need to get three fucking fuses let's see I'm gonna have to hide in there so oh boy You're gonna, you're gonna jump up, aren't you? Well, maybe not with, ugh, maybe not with that leg. Does this? Pray for revelation, huh? All right, that was a quick prayer. Go ahead and leave that guy right there. Woo! Sorry, we're closed. to. 
drive in the nails. Got a fuse. Should somebody tell them if this is supposed to be like Jeebus, it needs to be the other way around? There's my other finger gone. The bone is still sticking out. How wonderful. How wonderful. Okay, so where is this other guy? If he's gonna walk in here, but if he does, I am gonna fucking run. Go ahead and stay in there, buddy! Okay, it's one fuse. Let's just assume he'll be stuck in there forever, which he won't be. We're going to go ahead and assume that, because that makes it so I can sleep. Fight the wall rider. I'd rather not. Quick look around the room. Some files. Got, uh, it's a, ooh, we got some battery. It's my battery now. Okay, fuse number two. <laughs> he, uh, he got out. nowhere for me to hide in here. might be ambient noise. <laughs> oh, 
the time for him to come around the goddamn corner! It wasn't just ambient noise, I don't think it was, I think it was him. Appears to be doing his rounds. Go ahead. Shut that door. Hi, fella. That's a pretty mean looking cleaver you got there. I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna have a look around the room real quick, okay? So you just just chill out. I'm just gonna borrow that battery. Okay? Main calm. Now, I'm gonna just go ahead and borrow that. That. Let's play. Can you move? We're good. Just need to get back to the room. running.
I got in here. up through there, didn't I? Jerk it in the corner. We don't need to be here. Though I didn't see any other spots. See, unless I can use that, which I doubt I could. Do you get the uh, you get the key? No. All right, you stay there. So many batteries, though. Down to two extra. <laughs> Buddy, we're cool, man. For opening the door. I fucking fell. He hit me. Ah, what the fuck? I hit. Oh my god. I hit the space bar. The first time he gave just Spamming the fucking jump button. Fuck it, no fear. Let's just run right past this prick. You can't get me! You can't parkour. What's going on, man? How you been? Where the fuck was it? Oh, wait. Did I just need it for this door? Hey. We're not a savage. We're going to close the door behind us. God, that actually... 
actually looked like it hurt. Like, he hit his fucking chest right on that board. You're fantastic? Well, that's good. That's what I want to hear. Follow the blood. Eh, great. Now, the only plus side of getting bludgeoned to death was the fact that I got to uh, get a free battery out of that. Okay, well, the blood wants me to go that way. But I want to see what's over here. A dead guy. I'm not going to get many opportunities to do that, so I'm just going to teabag that asshole. I am doing okay. I'm tired. And I meant to finish this game yesterday. Ooh. Just watched the Blair Witch Project last night, so this game is quite fitting. I guess I meant to finish this game last night, but, um, just, I got home, I got off work, I went to my sister's place for dinner, didn't get home until like 9.30, by the time I finished showering and whatnot, uh, but I just, I just didn't have it in me. But tonight, tonight I am definitely going to try to finish this. Oh! That was the wall rider that I just, like, hugged with my face! Oh, I gotta sit in the corner. Oh. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Like, I didn't... I didn't think the floor was gonna break. But I had a feeling something like that was going to happen, because just years of playing video games, the floor looked different. So I was like, well, let me see if I can't jump it and, like, skip this whole part, and the game won't let you do that. That's stuck somewhere in this game. I would say I've been stuck, stuck in a couple spots, but there have been a couple spots where I've been like, okay, what do I have to do? Another battery? Fuck yes! Why is this area so rich in batteries? Reload. Like I said, though, th these batteries in this game are like, or in any game that has like a flashlight or something that you need to see. It's like they're the zebra stripe uh, gum of batteries. It's like you chew them and you're like, oh, I got them and the flavor's gone. Nonchalantly go over here. I mean, you don't have a battery bathroom in your house. You mean to tell me that you do have a battery bathroom? Hey, look, a file. Let's see. Excerpt from Diary of Shirley Pierce, Mount Massive Mental Hospital, patient 1952-1964. How can I not remember where the cuts are coming from? They hurt so deeply, even days later. Dr. Newhouse tells me that it's my fault. I'm subconsciously resisting the hypnotherapy, but I want so much to get better. I don't know how I could be doing this to myself. Dr. Newhouse says it's another condition of my bedroom-inspired hysteria. Poor Bruce. I make him suffer so. I've tried subtly to ask Miss Jackson if she's had similar issues with her husband. But she's either loath to talk about it, or, but she is loath to talk about it. Her husband, too, has found comfort in a younger woman. Oh. I know that doctors only mean well, and with the help of the government men who've joined the staff, I'm very 
I'm in the very best of hands possible. I should just take my pills and sleep and hope for more pleasant dreams tonight. That's right. Shut up and take your medicine. Fuck yeah, another battery! See that? Look at that. You see it? Right there. And right there. It's a different color. Make my ass fall all the way down. What is in here? Recognize the handwriting. Father Martin killed the man here. Are the lies he's talking about? All the files missing from these boxes? The facts? The records? They look like government agency material. At least 30 years old. Probably older. I start think. Really, he refers to himself in the third person here. I start thinking. MK Ultra CIA mind control. The buzzing won't stop. Excuse me! Woo! Sorry to disturb you! This is not where I wanted to be. As a naked man! was a very naked man. <laughs> oh. Hey, I'm over here! Hey, yeah, you're shining a light right at me. You wanna give me some help? Maybe a gun, machete, that flashlight that seems to have unlimited power in the batteries. You know where I can get some better batteries? Martin? I don't think you can hear me. Oh, God. I have a feeling I'm going to get pushed or this is going to break. Somebody's going to Kool-Aid through the wall. Maybe one of those naked guys. I make that jump? Or does that break? What if I just fall down here? Do I die? Fuck it for science. I can't open that door. I always climb back up. Try again. And that door's locked. Alright. Oh, 
No, naked man, you can't come and get me. You stay out there with your brother. Or your friend. Your special friend. Whatever. But I like how they don't run. Like, they saw me open the door, and they were like, Let's get him, but slowly. No, 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 Forget the camera. You don't need the camera. Oh. Naked guy. Climb, 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 climb. Well. Shit on my dick. All the other times I've made a jump like that, he doesn't lose the camera. This one time, he huh, foo, throws the camera. He chucked that motherfucker. I like how I can only hold five batteries, too. I must be wearing women's pants with the tiny pockets. It's a good thing I found all those batteries. It's a good thing I found all those batteries. You have pockets? <laughs> I mean... You know this... He's wearing blue jeans. So he's know he, you know he has pockets. His jacket probably has pockets. He's got a button-up shirt, so it's probably got that little pocket on the chest on the left-hand side. You know what I'm talking about. Skinny jeans. <laughs> oh. Any chances my camera's okay? I, think I, got, I hope I got the warranty for it. You know I didn't get the warranty. You bought that camera at Best Buy. You can only carry batteries. But it hurts when you walk. That's some D&D &D level shit right there. You can carry batteries, but you're in constant pain. <laughs> it's amazing how bright this is now. I guess I'm it. He tagged me. Hey, it's this dude. Wait, you're not. You're probably not the same dude. Yeah, right there, buddy. Ooh, that looks like it hurts a little. All right, I'm. Uh, I'll leave you to it, pal. I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Please listen. Nah, I mean, you remember, it's always when it was me and you, it was like, alright, let's go in there. Oh, hey, there's that dead guy. We got the butcher to kill. Alright, let's listen to him. <laughs> Just cut him up. I would love to see that played out in real life. It's like, Plet, I got it, buddy. I got it. <laughs> you just shut up and die. Is that my camera? It's my camera, yo! Pick up the camera! <laughs> Should have been remet. Yeah, a Diablo 1 remaster would have been cool, but... I like that they're doing... Why can't I pick up the fucking camera? Pick it up. Oh. Oh, can't... Can't crawl under here. Apparently my guy's too stupid to reach over and pick it up. Grab the camera. 
that just honestly that scared the shit out of me because I hit E while I was running. Oh, I just had to walk around. Everything's still good? You still good? Uh, there's a slight crack. That means somebody's behind me! I'm just gonna run! Oh my god, that is not what I wanted to do! Sorry, fellas! Camera, I'm gonna need you to not do that. put this here can I push it out of the way no I cannot because I have to go through here I mean who knows we might get a Diablo 1 remaster either that or it is probably to that point where it's like ah this is just it's too old at this point uh, granted, I think a lot of people loved the first Diablo. I mean, you know they did. But Diablo 2, I think, was far uh, more popular. That's probably why it got a remaster. Maybe on, the, on Diablo's 50th year anniversary, we'll get a uh, remaster of it. Right. <gasps> There's a battery. Did I miss that? Oh, I missed it. A battery that got away. Which way? Ooh. Ooh. Show me anger. Show me fear. <laughs> Did he just throw up a gang sign? <laughs> Alright. Stay here. How do you know you're not a patient? Because I came in here through. Well, it wasn't the front door. This place seems to be quite absent of blood and guts. And the game just gave me a save. And of course, Walker's there. Heard me slam the door. Dang, I mean. Too. Just gonna hi 
wait here. He won't come down this hallway. I'm dead. Nicely. Yeah, I'm dead. There's nothing here. Check out the other room. It's got a sofa. You can lay down! Ever tried crouch walking? It's uh, incredibly hard to do. Why did I come back in here? Just push the latch. <laughs> he was literally standing in the bathroom. Is he gone? Except the bathroom with two doors that I may be able to get away from him and so I need to check out one door that's like partially open. down here. I swear to God, if the vent breaks, I'm going to be pissed. Oh. Is he going to break that door down? You give me a bitch and break the door? He broke something else.
Wrong thing. Nope, that was the right thing. Miller's Dreams! Hey, Sydney! Sydney? Sydney. Sydney. Why was I thinking Sydney? Another interesting conversation with Billy this morning. He says he's been talking to Dr. Wernicke again for his therapy in the white place. I'm disturbed by the fact that his delusions have only gotten worse with medication, which isn't in the literature for benzodiazepine? I have no idea. In any case, his dead doctor friend is filling his head with more German folklore. Apparently, the only thing that can kill the wall rider are vampiric butterflies vounded from a demon called... <laughs> Horacy? The butterflies suck the breath from people's lips and drink the blood from their nipples. <laughs> they can only t also take the form of emancipated upright pigs or sick dogs. So Billy's got that going for him. You mentioned Billy talking about his mother's tattoos before. And are any of them, by chance, tattoos of butterflies? Next time I get outside of the Murkoff firewall, I'm going to look online to see if there's any actual basis in German folklore, or if Billy's making this garbage up from whole cloth. Would love to compare notes sometime. Wouldn't mind getting it over a glass of wine. Winky face. Gets lonely up here on two. Kurt. Fuck you, Kurt. That's sexual harassment. You've been reported, and you've been fired. Unwanted attention and Sydney is uh, Sydney. There it is. Cindy isn't having any of it. Hey, but he had the right idea, but uh, he just didn't make it. Okay. Um. Either he's gonna come from that door or that door, cause. There's a chair and something else blocking that way, so I can't get in through there. Okay. Wait, is this... This is the beginning. Isn't it? I think this is the beginning of the game. Oh, file. Berlin, September 6, 1938. Reisner Lorne and Dr. Med Rog. I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work of Dr. Rudolf Wernicke in his development of a morphogenic engine, expanding on theories developed in his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turing. If I had not witnessed it myself, I would not believe it had happened. But beyond even the promise in cellular regeneration and guided cancer, <laughs> cancer generation, can, yeah, cancer generation, I believe Rinicky's method has breached the spiritual realm. Something crossed from the other side. I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition, briefly, but undeniably so. Please forward my note and invitation to witness further experiments to direct Eckhart, Eckhart, I do not believe, blah, I do not doubt that the Fuhrer himself may need to be aware of our discoveries. It is in my opinion that Dr. Rinicke's success represents an enormous opportunity for our cause and the German people and are obviously sufficient reasons to keep him out of any sort of culling program. Regards to your family, signature, and eligible. Redacted! <laughs> right. Everything is redacted. They don't have to say redacted anymore. Alright, so the chapel. Yes, I'm supposed to tell you. The key to the house of God is in the theater. Behind the light. In the theater, behind the light. You have to see the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Friends! Children! I need your help! Yes, coming! I'm coming! You couldn't, like... 
You're on the other side! <sighs> the recreation hall is one floor up. It's one floor down. A locked door. It's locked. Of course it is. Step through the watery blood again. Dude, it's glass. Just smash it and open it from the other side. Ah, the rec room. He went up for a game of billiards? I'm awful at him. Why does that sound like there's a gas leak? Because there is a gas leak. Sure as shit. I'm gonna need you to calm down a little bit, alright? It ain't that scary. It's just gas. Probably smells real bad, but it's just gas. You'll be fine. Alright, think thin. Okay. Like a champ. Open. Of course. Dude, that was actually beautiful. You can keep playing. Hey, go, go back. Keep playing, man. It was good. Don't be creepy. Just because your mouth looks like that, don't be creepy. It was really good. I must have took, taken him out of the zone. You know? how musicians are. Once they get into a groove, they don't want to be disturbed, they can't really hear anything. But then when you fuck them up, they're, they're mad at you forever. Okay, I think you're dead. You're definitely dead. Can I play the piano? I'm missing some fingers. Pick up the candle. Uh, exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. This is on camera. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. The films are real. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all? No trickery? None. Taking the seat. In June of 1943, you reported three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. Mm. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English words are insufficient. More than hope. The human mind in that environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... The proximity to death. To 
overwhelming madness. Hmm. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of. The man sounds like Doctor Strange loves anemic brother. It's it's a 25 year old audio recording. An interview with this Doctor Wernicke, Los Alamos means government work. Wernicke talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumors, psychomatic reactions, and sufficiently disturbed people. Seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mysticism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine, the morphogenic engine. The engine, the movies project, they're projecting, it gets in my head like a song you can't stop humming. I blink and I see Rorschach tests that look like swarming insects and infected surgery wounds. Ugh. The patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's the buzzing I hear in my bones. Activating the engine. I also got the achievement testing. educated. What is that? Collect 15 documents and 15 recordings. Hey. Something supernatural. No. Do you think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing. You all enjoying this? Then what was it? You said Project Wellrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? Five bucks is locked. You just lost five dollars. You got a battery in here? No, no battery? You have to find Vernicky. Only way. Okay. Email. Wash those hands regularly on September 19th, 2013 at 4.19am. Grant, Rickoff wrote, Negritizing fetitesis? I have no idea. Really? I fucking quit. Flesh-eating bacteria. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I quit. Is this door open? Flesh eating bacteria. Mm, boy. Because there wasn't enough bullshit going on at this place. <laughs> fucking Nazi scientists and their crazy fucking hopes that they'd win the war with weird occult artifacts. Buddy, I need in there. Ah. It's 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 just ev it's everything. It's everything. You tell me that that asshole locked the door, shimmied all the way over here, and then just ran away like an asshole. <laughs> I'm so glad this banister didn't break. I don't know if I can survive another fall. And now the door is open. Can this door be open? Because that'd be great. Of course not. Bro, 
broke in to the lecture hall. I'm telling you though, if like the music wasn't on, I don't think this game would be as terrifying. Or any game, movie, what have you. If you could just like isolate the music in a movie and watch it without it, it just it just wouldn't be as scary. Saw a dude walking with his wang flailing in the wind and a big machete in his hand. Apparently, he didn't hear me slam the door. Hey, come on, broski. Wait, how's the battery on this? It's dead. <sighs> He's just hovering outside the room. Sorry, fellas. The church is closed to you. You must have shoes and pants. You know what they say? No shirt, no shoes, no service. Dude, what if I needed to go? Alright. Hey, another kitchen. This one has a lot less body parts on it. Look at that. Enemy right there. Thank you, severed arm. Hey, buddy. You played the piano really well. Is this where you get your inspiration? Is this your thinking spot? Alright. Good talk. room seems to be intact. I can squeeze through here. Hold on, I don't want to disturb him. He's he's praying. Let's not be a dick. He's praying. Okay, let's not disturb him either. Well, let's go ahead and take a pool cue 
break it, and then we have ourselves a short spear. I'll just close this for you, buddy. Okay, there you go. Now you won't get disturbed. Just pretend I'm not here, okay, man? Got you. There you go. You're okay. And... Anybody taking a dump? It's okay. It's like the book says, everybody poops. I've been in a lot of bathrooms in this game. I have yet to see... Uh, one thing of soap, so that I could maybe be, maybe be, maybe wash my hands. Well, looks like I'm going to have to go outside that window. Sorry to disturb you, sir. Father Martin has really got these guys all wrapped around his finger. Ooh. No. Thought that was leading somewhere cool. Did not. I'm gonna go out this window, okay, buddy? I like, I think that I'm videotaping this as I'm doing this. It's like I gotta get this awesome shit on camera. If I die, somebody will notice this and be like, that guy was a badass. God hates sickness. I bet he does. Maybe you shouldn't have made so much of it then. This is where that asshole was. If he hadn't closed the door, I wouldn't have had to go outside and show off my parkour skills. Hey, pal. <gasps> it's the naked guys! Did you know those guys tried to kill me? Fucking Neanderthal looking motherfucker. Hey, you too. The fucking crazy eyes and your dicks hanging out. The fuck's wrong with you? That shit is nasty. Put some fucking pants on. My job. You alone shall escape. Take like that. This is your penultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. <laughs> and, and here it is. I thought that guy was wearing a Michael Myers mask. It's just his face. His hideously scarred face. And together we will be free. You are no longer in danger. You fix the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us I don't think it's going to end well for Father Martin. Christ himself in shitty ways to die. And I don't believe I'm going to miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth, now I've got a way out. And a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. Berto Ken Banhammer. I call upon either of you to swing the mighty hammer of man.
Thanks, fellas. Are we cool now? Well, I still don't trust you, so... Asshole stay in there. He did still try to kill me. Really? I gotta... Oh, it's right here. I gotta take the fucking long way around? I... Thank you very much! Let's get the fuck out of here! <sighs> nope! Of course, of course, the secret underground bunker base. Just like the Nazis said. What the f Is that a Celtic knot? Or am I wrong? Good morning, Mr. Freeman. Where's Barney? He should be at the desk. Fuck, 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 fuck. Whoever finds my corpse, trust no one and tell everyone. I am not crazy. I know, I know. Only crazy people say that. But I am as sane as this word allows. With a camera full of evidence... Don't call it gospel. Call it a mockery of reason. Let the world know it is Murkoff's fault. Bury these bastards with my mutilated dead body. Well, at least he knows. He's like, yeah, I ain't, I ain't getting out of here. That ain't happening. Frankenstein, or the Modern Prometheus, by Mary Shelley, published anonymously in 1818, chapter 23, excerpt. Man, I cried, how ignorant art thou in thy pride of wisdom. Cease! You know not what it is you say. 
I broke from the house, angry and disturbed, and retired to meditate on some other mode of action. Ooh. That guy got, uh, that was a bloody mess perk. That's what happened to that guy. Form note, all material herein to be transcribed and revised to fit legally binding requirements of Murkoff Corp. Records. See Form 4083. Author, Jennifer Rowland. Notes, my 14th autopsy of Wallrider patient showing no more signs of accepting the therapy than any of the others. There have been slight gains in cell migration and morph morpho morphogenesis. Including effects similar to human growth hormone, but nothing to suggest the stable creation of a sentient independent swarm. So tired. Doubting my judgment. Will submit another request for leave. The psychological cost of using such far gone and further provoked patients is more than I feel I can handle. May suggest hanging less hope on the far flung theories of a senile Nazi and move towards using a simpler mechanical engine based on. Major sperm protein. While de <laughs> will definitely suggest harsher chemical restraints, Murkoff security killed patient 921 after he overcame his tranquil enough tranquilizers to put down a hockey team. I'm afraid the hormone therapy is interacting with our chemical restraints in a counterproductive manner. Delivery exit. Ah, oh, he almost made it. Our cart. <gasps> Fucking freedom, baby. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm stepping on your guts, buddy. He got halved. No! What the fuck is this naked guy? Oh my god, it's oh, it's the wall rider. <laughs> I kind of had a feeling that was going to happen, but I did it anyways. Time to run! Our court! Don't look back! Don't look back! Hey, quick look back! He's not there! Oh! Shit! The bit! It's this guy! Fuck you, Chris Walker! Get fucked! Yeah, we're videotape this shit. Ooh! Ooh! Get fucked, Walker! Ooh! Well then! He got cheese grated! This is the way you die, ripped to pieces from the inside, watching your marrow scatter on a concrete wall. You've escaped one hell, Chris Walker. God help me, but I somehow hope you didn't find another. Ooh. 
eat a dick, Chris Walker. <laughs> that would have teabagged your corpse. It wasn't my kill. But it happened. I can't go that way anyway. Oh, I think that's supposed to be Prometheus. I am older than sin, but somehow the only one left because of Billy. He takes care of Well, that's, that's the good doctor right there. I'm his father. He certainly loves me, poor idiot. You know what this symbol represents? It warns of a nano hazard. Microscopic machines. Technology we have had for decades but never mastered. Birkhoff discovered in my research a war command. Turning the cells in the human body into nano factories. It's the natural function of cells to produce molecules, but through psychosomatic direction, we engineered the precise molecules necessary. Mind over body. It was You know, I have to say, when I looked out the garage and saw that the lights were on, uh, that the lights were on, that the sun came out, um, it was literally just raining as I rode the elevator down, and still night. And yet, the sun came up in, like, the matter of an elevator ride. Ooh. This guy had Taco Bell. Oh. Oh, buddy. Just close that. That sucks. These aren't digs at Taco Bell. I've eaten Taco Bell a lot throughout my life, and I've never had that type of reaction. I don't want to know what's in there. Go left. from an entity that can just fly There he 
is. I just, I'm just running at this point. Oh, here, I'll file that for you, buddy. Thanks. Note to all personnel from Consult MM008, Rudolph Renicki, do not worship the swarm, nor allow the delusions of the patients to influence your beliefs. Any sentient being based in this technology will be so far superior to us that illusions of godliness will be reasonable. We have always looked into chaos and called it God. We are. We now are blessed with sufficient power that such belief could destroy us. Do not be tempted. Remember that you are scientists. Guess that uh, memo didn't get out. The fuck. The assembler, the feed chambers, the precursor molecules, vague memories of nanotechnology articles I've read online, probably drunk, probably distracted, not nearly enough to know how to destroy it. But Billy's at the center of it, find him, kill him, end this. Okay, so I'm at end of the game. I'll probably die another 17 times to Billy, who can just through the walls and shit. Turn off the valve for the life support fluid. Is this Billy? Billy is in incredible shape. He looks like a guy from fucking uh, Ark. And whoever was in here, he's dead as dicks. Hey, buddy. Alright, what's this way? Life support fluid reservoir. Time. Chapter 4, I'm sure. Learn from me, if not by my precepts, at least by my example. How dangerous is the acquirement of knowledge, and how much happier the modest man than he who aspires to become greater than nature allows. His nature allows. Do not turn the valve. I have turned the valve. Something else in here I have to hit. No! D block, you can D block these nuts! Sorry, Wall Rider, we're closed. Got no life support. I gotta hand it to this guy. He's got the stamina of fucking Sonic the Hedgehog. Just gotta go fast. Fucking switchbacks. Got. Ah! 
was right behind me! No more life support. No more wherever the fuck that thing was that I just turned off. Captain America Civil War. Multiple contusions detected. I detected that too. What? Nope! Can't parkour that! Okay, that's nothing. I think I gotta go up here. Nope! Oh shit! Jesus Christ! And I'm dead. to go up there to hit like a turn off switch and the other part of me was like well maybe it's right at where that dude is but I didn't see anything pop up see there's nothing there Say I ended the game with five batteries and a full battery in the camera. Oh, God, that just looks so painful. 
fall. Fuck, I didn't realize I was this close when I stopped last time. This is going to be a short-ass stream. This is as fast as I can move. In the superhero pose. Pull out the camera. I should have got that on film. It would have been super cool slow mo. God in Himmler. You have become the host. Newsman became the host. And that's the end of the game! Oh. <laughs> Had to say... The music... Definitely on point for that game. Definitely made you feel like, I gotta go! That was some good shit. And it is only 10 o'clock. I know I've said that before, but it is only 10 o'clock. Well, that was good. What did you all think? Uh, what should be next? was kind of an abrupt end, right? Because it's like, you go through the whole hospital, and then like it seemed like the ending was kind of rushed. It was almost as if maybe they didn't know how exactly they wanted to end it. And then they were like, well, why don't we just because it, like, it definitely had, like, the potential to be a, a bit longer. Because of all, like, the nano machines and this and that and whatever else. It's like, well, that's, that's, you know, there could be more to it with this. But it was just like, look, dude, you gotta kill this motherfucker. It's like, well, our guy, he either dies or, I mean, he, I don't know. Because Billy died and the wall rider just kind of went into me. So I would assume either the guy that we played as dies and the wall rider just jumps into one of the other guys. Either that or I become the host and stay the host. Either way, it was still good. And that's it. That's it. It's all over. There's Whistleblower, and that takes place before this game. Um, I just don't feel like doing the DLC. I feel just doing the main game was good enough. 
But I uh either way Half Life 3 confirmed. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed it, because I know I did. And I like I said, I guess this is just gonna be a short stream for tonight. It's only two hours. And I guess I gotta I gotta find something else to stream. Maybe I'll go back to uh, Cyberpunk for a little bit. But not uh, not tonight. Tonight I actually I'm gonna get something to eat and go to bed. It's three o'clock in the morning. Comes quickly, and that's, I gotta go to the gym. So with that, I hope you all have yourselves a good night. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I kept you entertained. Um, and until next time, be awesome.